back to Vanguard Motor Sales. I'm Greg, and this is a Backdraft Cobra. She's got a 427 stroker under the hood. It's an RT4, and she is beautiful. Look at the color on this thing. I absolutely love the color. That maroon is looking sweet with the white stripes, just absolutely gorgeous. And then we've got that 427 stroker under the hood. Now these cars are really, really cool guys because I know a lot of people call them kit cars, but backdrafts are not really kit cars. These things are built in a factory by the backdraft mechanics. They completely put them together. They paint them, they do the suspension, they do all the wiring, they do all the plumbing. The only thing that gets done once they hit the states here is they slip in the motor and trans. As you look down the side, man, the paint work is just sweet as can be. They got the true knockoff wheels, just like they used to use back in the day. The side pipes are all shiny and stainless, looking good. I mean, everything about the car just looking absolutely gorgeous. Now, as you look down the side, man, the stance on it, I mean, it is a race car and it looks like one, doesn't it? We got the, uh, looks like a chrome roll bar in there. And then we've got the diamond stitched interior with the four point harness in there the wood steering wheel. I mean, everything about the car is just slick as can be. Now I say it in just about every video I do on one of these, is these are one of my favorite cars to hop in, have some fun in, whenever we're going to a show, anything we're going to, man, I'm wanting to drive a Cobra because they are just a blast to get out on the road. And you wanna talk about attention getters? Everybody knows what these Cobras are, so everybody wants to come up to you and talk about them. Just absolutely super, super cool cars here. The white stripes really set it off, looking sweet. Of course, we've got the, uh, now a lot of people ask about these. Back in the day, they had the uh, bumper jack. They put a device on there and they'd push down on it, lift up the cars, hit the knockoffs, get the new tires on, get right back out on the track. She's just looking absolutely gorgeous. The hips on this thing just look beautiful, man. I'll tell you what, I'm in love. Now at Vanguard Motor Sales, we do not do consignment. That means we buy every one of our vehicles that you see in our inventory. We have a whole team of buyers that comb the whole United States on the internet, on paper, everything and then they get all the pictures they do all the research on the cars then we physically go out and look at every one of them so you don't have to Cobra time, let's go, backdraft baby, 427, 5 speed, feeling good, looking good, sounding amazing, just love the exhaust on these things. Now one of the cool things about these side pipes, as long as you behave yourself, you probably won't get arrested, but if you want to get arrested, just open her up, take it up to about four or 5,000 RPM and let her scream. Now we can deliver this beauty anywhere in the world and Tom will take care of all the paperwork for you. So you just give him a call, he'll tell you how easy it is to park this dream in your driveway and you can have fun like I do every time I hop in one of these babies. Tell you what, it is just a blast to drive, it's a blast to listen to, it's a blast to take to a car show and talk to everybody about it all day long. Tell you what, she is an attention getter. Just as smooth as can be. Of course, these things are basically built to be race cars, so they don't drive like your Cadillac, drives like a race car, so have some fun in it. Now down here on the dash, we got a real simple operation. We got all the gauges you need. Got water temp, voltage, RPM, speedo. Of course, you don't need that speedo. Just put the hammer down and have some fun. 
Now, if you'd like to come in and check it out in person, we'd love to have you. Or if you want to send an inspector, we got no problem with your inspector. We will treat the inspector just like we treat you. If you need to fly in, we'll even send somebody down to the airport to pick you up. Now we're about to do something that nobody else in the industry does. We're gonna put this baby up on the left. Now we do that to every one of our cars. I don't know anybody else that does it to every car. Of course, they pick out their uh, top 2% of their cars and put them up. We put every one of ours up in the air. And we're headed back to the shop right now here in the Motor City to do that. We're at 15100 Keel Street here in Plymouth, Michigan. And we're gonna put this thing up on the lift. We're gonna show you the suspension, then we'll get the hood up and take a look at the motor. We are underneath the Cobra now, and man, it is pretty under here. You can tell how well kept this thing has been. Um, gas tank's clean as a whistle. Now we got tie downs right here, and you guys that watch videos all the time, I'm gonna say it again. Don't tie this thing to a trailer, drive it. But if you have to, you got tie downs. We've got the RT4 here. This uh, rear end suspension here is 8.8 uh, .8, uh, Ford rear end. Looks like it says 355 gear there. Um, and of course, it's fully adjustable. Camber caster, whole nine yards. Uh, there's a sway bar up in there. Coilovers, those are also adjustable. We got great looking paint on the frame. I mean, it is clean as a whistle under here. Of course, we've got the uh, Tremec um, five speed transmission with a hydraulic clutch fuel filter right here, high torque starter, jet coated headers. Then they have the traditional BMW front suspension that they always ran, rack and pinion steering, and it is manual rack and pinion. A lot of the guys like the uh, manual steering on these cars, get a lot better feel for the road. Uh, you can see we've got uh, strut style uh, coilover holding up the uh, front end also. Disc brakes up here, disc brakes out back. And then, of course, we got the tie downs up front that you're not supposed to use. You're supposed to drive this thing. Now, keep it off the curbs, too. This thing is only about that far off the ground, and it's going to scrape this all up if you hit a curb. Uh, we got the bumper jacks here. Now, on these cars, I would not suggest using the bumper jacks. These aren't designed to uh, actually lift the car like back in the day. But back in the day, they had that thing that went under there and lift the car right up, and they could change the tires real quick. And one of the reasons they could change the tires real quick is because of these knockoffs. Now, the knockoffs knock off towards the front of the car. So if you want to take the wheel off, you hit it towards the front of the car. It doesn't matter whether you're on the driver's side or the passenger side hit it towards the front of the car. The tie wire on here is for good looks on a backdraft. That center cap right there actually tells you which way to spin it. That's actually the safety device to make sure this stays nice and tight. You can see that the headers are all polished up, looking good. That, uh, they look like they're stainless steel. Really, really pretty. Of course, I love the paint color. You can see how clean everything is. Just absolutely gorgeous. Now out back, we got a lot of rubber on the road because this is where the horsepower meets the road. We've got uh, 295, 30, 18s. And of course those are, oh, there's so 295, 40, 18s. I can't see very good anymore. Let's get under the hood. All right, under the hood here, we got 427 stroker. Uh, they start out with a 351 Windsor block and then they put a stroker crank in it to get the 427 cubic inches. We've got um, power brakes. I told you about the manual steering. You can see everything under here that can be polished is polished. Everything under here that can be aluminum is aluminum. We got an electric fan keeping it cool. Um, MSD um, um, coil there. I mean, everything's looking sweet in here, guys. She's a Cobra. She's gorgeous, 427 power. Tremic Transmission, give us a call, 248-974-9513, and let Vanguard Motor Sales Park this dream in your drive.